All right. All right. So he wanted me to do a song that um that we that uh it's actually kind of related to Islamic religion a little bit. Um, and two things. One thing you should know real quick is that David used to manage Native Dean years ago, and and to the point where the song that this album is recorded on was only made possible. He was one of the co-producers of it. Because we went on this long tour around the world, I remember. We went to like maybe like four or five countries, shows all over the place. And then when we got home, I was like, great, I'm going to have this big check from all these shows that we did. And then it was like, this is for the album, and this is for the music video. And I was like, two weeks, I'm going to go home with 400 bucks. It's great. <laughs> um, but no, that's the album that so many people like and love, is um, the standalone one. So, um, so... I went on a trip with I with Islamic Relief and it was one of Dr. It was actually Dr. Hani's <coughs> last trip with Islamic Relief official trip, um, and um, we were going to Mali, Chad, Niger to visit projects. And we met him in Heathrow, and we, we were having tea or whatever. He's like, "Yeah, we're going to these countries and we're going to pray for the rain and it's going to happen." And I was like, "He didn't say inshallah. He didn't say anything. He just said it's going to happen." And then um, he said, and then he said. And it's only not going to happen if you don't believe it. And then it was like, what? <laughs> it was like back on us. So we're going through all these countries. We went through Chad. We're now in Niger driving through all types of madness. Like we walked through, we drove through all that. So then it was the night before we're going to do this prayer for rain. And I didn't really know much about, you guys know Slata, it's this cough. It's the prayer for rain. So, um, so we went there. And it was the night before. And Dr. Hanny was like, again, Tomorrow we're gonna to do this prayer, um, and and it's gonna happen. And the only reason it won't happen is because one of you don't believe in it. And then he said, "So tonight, I want everybody to stay up, make it look far, do whatever you need to do, and prepare yourself for this moment." Allah Alaihim. That night I was we were in three four countries or whatever, and I was like dead tired, and I didn't do much that night. I went to sleep to be honest. So now we're going to this town where it's about to happen. Um, he's like, start singing, who wants to hear the story? So now we go to this town where it's going to happen, and we are getting out the car. And as we get there, Dr. Henny is like, um, we, pulled the ra we pulled the rain from the ground, or the water from the ground, because they had a drill there, a, whole, um, uh, a well just then. But we're going to show them where that water comes from. And um, so we're getting out the car, and my buddy Nadia, who was like our photographer at the time, gets out too, and she's like, I stayed up all night for this, like getting ready for this. I'm like, oh crap, I'm that guy he's talking about. <laughs> so um, we get there and we start praying. And um, I remember we were standing up there for a while. And it was the first time I prayed it. And it was taking a long while. And then I was like, maybe this is not going to happen. And then, um, and then like, uh, as I said, then I thought to myself, if I lived in this city, if I lived in this town and it hadn't rained for as long as it, rained, it hadn't rained, I would be out here all night just begging a lot to bring the rain. So I renewed my intention. I was in it. I was in it. I was in it. And at one point, Dr. Hanny just starts, after he made this long dark, I was just, he was finished. And he just started going, Ya Allah, Ya Allah, like in a way. And I started to cry a little bit, just how passionate he was. And then that moment, I felt like two little drops on my shoulder. And then I was like, and then, and then it started raining. And I started crying, the guy next to me started crying, and we were just like, just bawling. And we were on the floor, and we, <clears throat> it rained so much in that moment, our cars were getting stuck in the mud, and it was just like, it, it wasn't just like a, and no, it was a serious rain. And um, so that was moving for me. So I was like, okay, I'm, I'm going to write a song before the trip's finished. And, and this is the song I wrote. It's all about stuff that Dr. Hanny said at the night. So it kind of went like this. He stamps sounds. <clears throat> sorry, it's been a while. He stamps outside into the scorching heat. The well is dry. The children cry. The lands they claim defeat. Oh my father, is it evil that we've done? He smiles at the child with faith in his eyes. Inshallah, the rains will come. This I know. His mercy must be won. Just open your heart. This is the start. Inshallah, the rains will come. 
on him I swear his will has his will must be done like tears from your eyes pearls from the sky inshallah the rains will come father gathers the people for their eyes to see that if they combine their hearts and their minds they'll turn the deserts green side by side they stand in the burning heat they pray to the one who brought them the sun to make the heavens weep this i know his mercy must be won just open your heart this is the start inshallah the rains will come on him i swear his will has been done he dropped tears from my eyes with pearls from the sky inshallah the rains will come will come shower your mercy and wash away the sun will come pour down your blessings until this drought is gone will come soak up our tears and let the rivers run will come answer will come answer believers Allah almighty one this I know his will has been done he dried the tears from my eyes with pearls from the sky for God that the rains have come on him I swear his will has been done he dried the tears from my eyes with pearls from the sky thank God that the rains have come done Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah.